won't fuck. I, I, I can lose trust. Why wrong? Easy pop. Where you they go, go, with they go up. Catch my fly. And coming up next, it's a UFC welterweight division matchup. So here we go with round one. Seems to be a situation in which he wants to do everything in his power to keep this fight on the feet. He'd appear to have a lot of advantages at distance. We'll see if he can get it done tonight. Yes, he has all the advantages because we don't see many specialists anymore in the UFC. Guys can generally do everything, but this guy is a jiu-jitsu player. He wants to get the fight to the ground and start to weave his web of trap to try and find a submission. This striker needs to maintain his space. He needs to make sure he is not on the ground. Whoa! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got to go very fast. Now goes in and secures the takedown. All right, so he postures up here and now figures to rain down some ground strikes. Yeah, the ground and pound will be a plenty from this position. Triangle. triangle looks pretty tight, DC. I'm no Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu black belt, but maybe not good here. No, it looks like it's getting in deep. My triangle, my triangle. He's to push the arm to the side. Get his head against the mat. Now watch as he goes to the finish. Watch his chest go to the mat. That is tight. Right into side control. Now he's gonna try to attack the Kimura here. The Kimura is not the arm, it's the shoulder pressure that usually makes you tap. Oh! And the turn on the elbow, and he's gonna change the submission finish. the win by submission, beautifully executed there on the ground. Let's take a look back at the replay as he gets it done by submission tonight, champ. He does a great job of staying patient. He doesn't rush or panic. You are never safe when you're fighting this guy. You're in a lot of trouble. You're in a lot of trouble the entire